everybody, it's Jordan. This is Brooke, Hayes' humble homestead. It's been a while since we've put out a video, like probably, I don't know, a year. It hasn't maybe? been that long. Maybe not though. quite. Um, yeah, it's been a while since we've put out a video and I've actually done a whole lot on uh, any social media. Uh, there's a lot of stuff going on in life and there was uh, some instances where another account was taking stuff that we kind of said out of context and regurgitating it as like something that they learned um, but not providing like the whole story or the background knowledge and information and research that we had done on certain projects and stuff and uh, just not get, um, being very genuine and so we kind of stopped took a break for a while because we were kind of discouraged about that and we felt like people were being set up to fail and that's really where our our discouragement really came in and we kind of let that take over yeah so we want to so we took a break for a while and we just kind of decided you know let's screw it we're gonna just keep doing us and keep being as genuine as possible showing you the highs and the lows of everything that we got going on here and uh it's not all fun all the time and um sometimes there's some uh you gotta take a good hard look at your numbers and stuff sometimes because the stuff doesn't always pencil out even though you want it to so we're gonna try putting out some more videos it's gonna be very low editing um not that our editing before was great but uh hey that's rude uh literally you're just gonna film it here on the phone and Small edits, try and keep the video short, like five to 10 minutes at most, and do a lot more like the how-to, um, kind of behind the scenes of stuff, and help share some of our, the stuff we've learned, some of the research and stuff that we've done on different things that we practice here in our lives, and run through, you know, some actual numbers and stuff, and how stuff actually works and or doesn't work yeah be totally transparent you know <laughs> we're not making money on it we'll we'll show you and what we do to uh maybe change that so that we can maybe become profitable on some stuff so short yeah, videos i meant the progress uh, the projects i was i was telling them the progress the projects that don't work oh yeah there's a few of those <laughs> but we're always learning and so yeah we want to take you guys along with for the journey hope you guys enjoy it and you got questions don't hesitate to reach out to us on you know instagram facebook or here on uh, on youtube we'll happy to help answer any questions we're not experts on anything but we do know a little bit about a lot and the little bit that we do know we've done some pretty good research on stuff and uh, have multiple sources where we get that information we have a lot of mentors that help us with a lot of things so just because we don't have answers for you doesn't mean we won't work really hard to connect you with people who have more knowledge than we do to get you those things what? he jumped up because the water is overflowing it's real life oh a whole bunch of ripe blackberries there oh let's wait another day or so but i don't care okay you go fishing I thought you were being transparent and you turned the camera off and jumped up because the water was overflowing. The water was overflowing. I didn't think they wanted to see me get up and go do that. So. Maybe they want to <sighs> talk to me. Maybe I had something good to share. But, yeah, I don't know. We've. Anything you want to kind of share that we've been going on lately? Um. We're, we're gonna, I'm gonna do like a whole series of videos, just kind of like updates of stuff that we've been doing around here. Um, so there will be a bunch of short little mini videos on all the different projects, things we've been working on, <clears throat> stuff like that. We added the farm stand. Yeah, farm There's stand. not a video out about that. That was kind of in like that whole thing that we were talking about earlier. We had, we started filming the building of it and then just kind of stopped. No, I, ha I have footage. All, all the way through? Yeah, I have footage all the way through. It's just never so been uploaded. Maybe we might put that together, but we'll give you updates on all the projects and stuff we've been work, kind of working on. And We've been working really hard to build community and um, 
in a lot of ways like genuine community yes. like-minded <laughs> But on people the farm, that want to see each other succeed and not just are in it for themselves. You know, they want to see, you know, obviously you want to succeed yourself, but you also want to see other people succeed as well. And supporting your community. But so we've been working on community, both um, farm community and we actually have a homeschool community here that um, we've helped organize. And um, then our online community, which is all here, but we also like feel like one of the biggest things with not being on socials is I felt like we missed those people so much and like we messaged with them a little bit but I would often get messages like hey you haven't posted hey are you okay like what's going on and so I talked to like some people behind the scenes but not necessarily publicly but I miss that community because that's how you learn and that's how you grow and you can get great ideas from other farms from what they're doing um to help grow your farm or maybe it's that maybe what you learn in that community isn't even for you it's for you to pass on to somebody else who is doing those things and that's what we love yep so we're we're excited to kind of be back and, and do this and we're planning on sticking with it and being consistent about it uh so we're gonna we're gonna try real hard on that um yeah the boys are all doing good they started doing some 4-h stuff which they seem to be really enjoying so it's kind of a new experience for us here because 4-H is totally different than it was when we grew up. It's very uh, different. So we're we're having to learn as well. Easton's showing goats this year. So he's excited about that. We're looking for... We're weird goat people. Uh, we're not goat people. That's what Jordan said. He said, we're not goat people. But funny enough, when we bought the property here, the first animals that we got were goats because we could pick them up for inexpensive and the property was already goat fenced. Easy. Yeah, it, they didn't take a whole lot of maintenance and we were super excited to like hit the ground running. So now Easton's gonna show those goats, but we're looking for some goats for him, like higher, not, not high quality, like, but higher quality goats than what we have. They can breed, because ours are weathers. But anyway, that's enough. We'll wrap this up. We'll catch you guys later.